Sarah McCallion reporting for the Broken Arrow Ledger newspaper. Today we are on location at the Broken Arrow Fire Department's Physical Resources Center with the new fire engine. The engine, which is paid for out of the regular budget, features many new technological advancements that will increase both efficiency and speed for the city's firefighters. Very high technology on it because it's all computer operated and functions. It has incorporated into it wireless headset system. It has incorporated into it new safety systems for the firefighters' safety inside the cab, as well as the way the equipment's mounted is uh, mounted so that it's safer for them and easier more ergonomically for them to remove the equipment from the truck and put it back in. Planning for the truck began about a year ago. Uh, we realized that uh, with the, uh, as times change, we needed to update the fleet, and that's an ongoing, uh, constant process. Uh, it seems like as soon as you finish one apparatus, you have to start planning for the next one uh, because we don't buy them all at once, obviously, given the cost. Uh, this apparatus, uh, uh, we had a budget of about $350,000, and about uh, 329, 330000 of that covered the cost of the apparatus itself, and about uh, $20,000 was spent on equipping it with new tools and equipment. This truck has a, what we call a short wheelbase. It has a very, very tight turning radius, and because of the size of the overall length of the truck, which is only 31 feet from bumper to the tailboard, and the maneuverability, we were able to get into Old Town area of Broken Arrow very easily. Uh, it has to be maneuverable in our narrow streets in Old Town. The newer areas of Broken Arrow, it's not that big a problem, but because Old Town has such narrow streets and tight corners, it's very difficult to get our bigger apparatus around. This truck will be a lot easier to get around throughout the city and especially throughout the Old Town area.